हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई एम सी एन भाजैया असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर इन डेयरी टेक्नोलॉजी डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ एस एम सी कॉलेज ऑफ डेयरी साइंस आई एम ऑल्सो कंटेंट राइटर इन पेपर ट्वेल्व फूड पैकेजिंग टेक्नोलॉजी एंड मॉड्यूल सेवेंटीन पैकेजिंग ऑफ कन्फेक्शनरी प्रोडक्ट्स इन दिस मॉड्यूल वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट पैकेजिंग रिक्वायरमेंट्स डिफरेंट पैकेजिंग मटेरियल्स यूज फॉर कन्फेक्शनरी प्रोडक्ट्स एंड द इफेक्ट ऑफ डिफरेंट पैकेजिंग मटेरियल on the self life of the confectionery products confectionery items are commonly consumed by people mainly for their taste and becoming very popular nowadays especially among children and youth there are various types of confectionery items available in market such as candies wafers chips chewing gum and chocolates there are some leading industries in this field of confectionery products they are the कैडबरी नेस्ले परफेटी रिगले पार्ले अमूल एट्सेट्रा एंड सेवजल स्पूजियस ब्रांड्स द मेजर फंक्शनल पैकेजिंग रिक्वायरमेंट्स फॉर कन्फेक्शनरी प्रोडक्ट्स इंक्लूड देयर प्रोटेक्शन फ्रॉम फर्स्ट मेनली डस्ट डट एंड अदर कंटेमिनेटिंग एजेंट्स एंड मॉइस्चर एंड वॉटर वेपर पिकअप और लॉस रिजल्टिंग इन sugar and fat bloom stickiness hardening and desiccation there are chances of rancidity due to interaction with moisture and oxygen and fat then there may be color and aroma loss and tainting there are also chances of physical damages like dusting breakage and loss of shape the water activity has a major role in uh, cell confectionery products mainly in shelf life the end of shelf life is due to moisture loss or gain is subsequent changes in textural and other properties and which is often uh, the main problem in confectionery items thus an understanding of water activity is important for control of shelf life and stability water activity in confections generally falls below the critical values for microbial growth with few exceptions water activity is influenced by the presence of dissolved sugars other sweeteners such as polyols salts in case of caramel and humectant in confections microbial growth is also directly related to water activity with certain types of microbes unable to grow when water activity is below some critical value the table shows the range of water activity and uh, water content in different confectionery products here we can see that hard candy is showing the minimum water activity of 0.25 to 0.4 while uh, jam is having the maximum water activity of 0.8 to 0.85 in confectionery items now there is direct relationship between water activity and microbial growth higher the water water activity more will be the microbial growth lower the water activity microbial growth will be poor hence majority of bacteria and uh, many yeast stop growing below the water activity of 0.88 above 0.88 the microbial growth will be better but uh, the cut off is 0.88 below which majority of bacteria stop growing and many yeast also stop growing only few osmophilic yeast and mold grow below water activity of 0.7 and no microorganism can grow below the water activity of 0.6 the growth range of the microorganisms in terms of water activity is uh, shown in the table package forms now we shall discuss about different package forms used for packaging of confectionery products in the coming slides looking to the flexible packages the basic styles of flexible pouch 
a bag used to contain sugar confections and chocolates are flat or pillow type, sesame bottom or stand up types. The material for construction comprises mainly of functional papers, plastics, aluminium foils, metalized films, and composites of this materials. Although conventionally different kinds of papers such as poster paper, glaze proof paper, or the glazing, or the vegetable parchment paper are used for making bags. Newer materials include polyolefins, polyethylene terephthalate, or PET, or polyester, or polyamide, or nylon, or aluminum metalized plastic films, and coextruded structures are being increasingly used. Since polyester, or polyamide, and metalized films possess very good behavior properties towards oxygen and aromas, but unsupported do not provide good heat sealing properties. They are generally combined with polyethylene and its modifications to provide wood sealability and inertness. Recent developments in flexible packaging field is the availability of coextruded structures. A most common combination suitable for sugar confectionaries is an outer layer, layer of polyethylene, whether the low density or the linear low density polyethylene, which is LDP or LLDP, and core or middle layer of polyamide or nylon 6 or ethylene vinyl alcohol copolymer and inner or the contact layer of ionomer or ethylene acrylic acid copolymer film. To enhance the shelf life of products, either vacuum or gas packaging can be resorted to. The former technique is suitable for packing of sweets having a rigid structure such as Son Papdi and Mysore Park, while gas packaging is more suited for softer confections. And for these applications, materials such as uh, polyester, polyamide, and metallized films uh, possess very good behavior properties towards oxygen and aromas, but do not provide good heat seals. They are generally combined with polyethylene and its modifications to provide solubility and inertness. Hence, the combination of uh, polyesters and polyethylene is more suitable for flex flexible packages for the confectionery items. Looking to the semi rigid containers, they comprise uh, folding cartons setup boxes, lined folding cartons, and thermofoil containers. Collapsible folding cartons of tray type with coated or laminated paperboard base are extensively used to package dairy food based sugar confections. These cartons with outer embellishments are best suited for gifts and display applications. The liner material may be polyethylene, wax, ethyl vinyl acetate blends or PVC or polyester films. Setup boxes of either half or full telescopic type having inner glassing liner are economical and provide good physical and mechanical protection. Lined folding cartons system is of bag in box type where the inner pouch is uh, fixed to the outer paperboard carton. The selection of the material of the pouch is decided by the functions required, economics and marketing requirements. Materials such as 
पेपर एंड पी और जो पॉलीएस्टर एंड पॉलीथिलीन और जो पेपर और एल्यूमिनियम फॉइल एंड पॉलीथिलीन आर द एंड द ऑलमोस्ट अल्टीमेट चॉइस प्रोविजन्स फॉर रिक्लोजिंग रिडक्शन ऑफ हेयर स्पेस वॉल्यूम एंड सच फीचर्स कैन बी इनकॉर्पोरेटेड थर्मोफॉर्म कंटेनर्स इंक्लूड ब्लिस्टर पैक्स सिंगल मल्टी कैविटी ट्रेस थीन वोल्ड कंटेनर्स विथ लिड्स एट्सेट्रा दीज आर प्रोड्यूस्ड बाय द प्रोसेस ऑफ थर्मोफॉर्मिंग बाय वैक्यूम प्रेसर और मेस टेक्निक्स फॉर पैकिंग स्वीट्स थर्मोफॉर्म ट्रे टाइप कंटेनर्स आर बेटर स्वीटेड इको फ्रेंडली पैकेजेस which are also known as bio containers and made up of natural materials such as leaves of banana can also be used to contain and distribute sugar based confectioneries the process was developed by cftri to manufacture this involved only heat treatment without recourse or any additional adhesive or chemical treatments and these are the eco friendly packages which will be packaging material for the future then the rigid packing systems this mainly consist of metal containers among the metal containers the conventional tin plate cans are being used to process rasgulla or gulab jamun with syrup for gas flushing applications formed cans with aluminum top cans are used newer metal containers include differentially coated cans chromium coated cans which is a tin free steel the provision of zinc pullants which is a easy opponents facilities for the is the opening for consumers aluminum containers are made by different techniques and these are available in circular oval rectangular any fancy shapes and can be decorated in an unlimited range of design and color variations is the open ends with reclosable polyethylene lids are finding data applications for sugar and dairy products then composite containers these are made up of paper board body and metal or plastic ends the container body may either be spirally or convolutely wound with fiber board lined with aluminum foil कंपोजिट कैन हैविंग ए बॉडी मटेरियल ऑफ ट्वेंटी फाइव एम एम पॉलीथिलीन एंड पेपर बोर्ड एंड पॉइंट जीरो जीरो नाइन एम एम ऑफ एल्यूमिनियम फॉइल एंड थर्टी सेवन एम एम एल डी पी आर वेल सुटेड टू पैकेज स्वीट मीट्स शिपिंग कंटेनर्स कोयोगेटेड फाइबर बॉक्सिस आर बींग एम्प्लॉयड एज एक्सट्रेजर कंटेनर्स फॉर पैकिंग यूनिट्स which packs both for inland and export markets they can be used up to maximum weight of content of 75 kg for designing packages the primary requisite is the knowledge of relationship between moisture content of the product and equilibrium relative humidity and hence uh, water activity denoted through moisture absorption isotherm now we will see some examples of uh, convex energy products and their storage studies first one is son pabdi this confection is normally has a shelf life of about 12 days with critical moisture content of 3% corresponding to 0.3 water activity chemical and sensory analysis carried out on bha treated packed products has indicated that the 
product could be stored well for 20 days in polyester and polyethylene pouches, 120 days in HDP which is high density polyethylene pouches and 225 days in uh, laminate containing paper, aluminum foil and polyethylene pouches and in rigid metal container. For and this product with permissible moisture pickup of 1.7 percent and stored at normal environmental conditions has revealed that storage life of 30 days in low density polyethylene, 120 days in high density polyethylene and 180 days in foil laminate pouches. Milk peda is having a water activity of 0 0.84 or 14 percent moisture, packed in laminates pouches of polyester and polyethylene and polyester and aluminum foil and polyethylene and co-extruded linear low density polyethylene, polyamide and ethylene acetic acid. As indicated that ambient air packaging did not extend the shelf life and usage of free oxygen absorber CSA extended the life up to 42 days. So friends, in this module we have discussed different uh, packaging requirements for confectionery products that what we have to keep in mind when we are packing the confectionery products then the different ma packaging material used for the uh, packaging and the effect of different packaging materials on the self-life of confectionery products. Thank you.